Dear colleagues and friends, greetings from the World Health Organization. On the eve of World Sepsis Day, it's my great pleasure to welcome you to the World Sepsis Congress Spotlight. This online congress is an excellent opportunity for people across the world to connect virtually to learn about sepsis. Every year, sepsis kills around 6 million people, including 1 million newborn babies. Sepsis is also one of the main causes of maternal death. It directly kills approximately 35,000 women every year and continues to an additional 100,000 maternal deaths. The tragedy is that most of these deaths could have been prevented. Overcrowded and poorly resourced health facilities put pregnant women and their babies at high risk of infection and sepsis. Unnecessary caesarean sections also increase this risk. We know that most infections can be prevented, and we know what's needed to reduce the risk of sepsis. Access to clean water and sanitation, access to quality care during pregnancy and birth, responsible and timely access to the right medicines, and proper infection prevention and control in hospitals and clinics. When patients show signs of sepsis, health workers need to know how to recognize them and manage this medical emergency quickly and properly. The World Health Organization recognizes the urgent need to pay more attention to this life-threatening but not so well-known condition. In May this year, the World Health Assembly passed a resolution to address the prevention, diagnosis, and management of sepsis. This online congress is one of the activities that WHO is spearheading as part of the global initiative on maternal and neonatal sepsis. We're also working with partners to support a large multi-country study on maternal sepsis in over 500 health facilities in 54 countries. We hope that the results of this study will improve our understanding of the prevalence of maternal sepsis and how it's prevented and treated around the world. I would like to thank all of WHO's dedicated partners for contributing to this initiative and the study. Today, we have thousands of passionate participants online from over 140 countries. I would also like to thank all of you for taking time out of your busy days to participate in this important Congress. You're the ones who can make a difference to prevent so many unnecessary deaths. I wish you every success in your work. I thank you.